Yes, Gaston Brown, I agree. As you say, a compulsive liar does require good memory. But you know, the deal that he is referring to, it was not a special economic zone. So this is like comparing a lion with a mango. Here are the facts. The agreement between the UPP and the Millennia Development Limited in 2011 was a standard agreement between an investor and the government to develop a resort at Seaforth's estate. But let's follow the money. The UPP did not waive $11 million in taxes to transfer the land title. That's an outright lie. It didn't happen. In 2009, the court had ordered the previous owners of the company to transfer the company and the land for 7.5 million US dollars. Whoever owns the company owns the land. So where does 11 million dollars come from? Even if you use 10% of 7.5 million, that's 750,000. So again, where does 11 million dollars come from? No. The Gaston Brown administration, they recently announced that the company had been taken over by someone else who now owns the land in question. And at the same time, the company has been granted a license to establish a special economic zone on the land. Under this license, all taxes are waived. Customs duty, environmental levy, ABST, the RRC, company tax, everything. And permission is given for a separate customs department run by the company and permission to hire a foreign labor force without any restrictions. All this at a time when people are being paid late, people are out of work, people are hungry. How can the Gaston Brown government justify giving away jobs to a foreign labor force, giving away our customs department to a foreign entity and robbing the treasury of everything. Now the UPP, we always put people first. In the agreement that he put out some screenshots of, he put it in a way that nobody can read it. But if you want to see what the real agreement is, which carefully lays out the UPP's terms and conditions for investment, you can see that for yourself in its entirety. Go to the My UPP Facebook page and you will see everything that you need to see. And you will see the truth. Who is the liar now?